Hey everybody, I'm back again today with another video and today, you know, your girl is coming at you with a handbag reveal Cheers! How are you guys doing today? I am doing quite well And today you guys I figured that I would share with you one of my latest handbag finds that I am truly obsessed with to the point that I literally have like five bags to share with you and if you're interested in this type of content just keep watching buy this brand called and please please excuse me if i butcher the name of the brand but i believe it's called nag nag hetty nag hetty nag hetty apparently she is a designer based out of new york city who makes these sustainable handbags pretty much made out of some sort of neoprene material and I am obsessed. I purchased all of these from Bloomingdale's. So, and I think at the time Bloomingdale's had like a, you know, they randomly do these gift card events or like these um, like 25% off like loyalist events. So I snatched these up during the 25% off. And I think I got some cash back too because I um, like used Ebates, I don't know. I got these on a good sale. Um, these are frequently out of stock and I purchased them in two different sizes and let's just get right on into it So this is one all Nagetti handbags come with this like cotton this like heavyweight Yellow cotton dust bag with this faux leather tab right here that says her name on it and then you have the faux leather drawstrings really substantial and nice um Dust bag. Here we are. You guys, this is so cute. Let me see if I can find the tag on them. Okay, this is called the St. Barf's Mini Toe. Okay, and this is in the color Cacao for $240. Again, as I mentioned, I got them on sale. You can get these on sale. I see that Saks puts them on sale sometimes, and as I mentioned, Bloomingdale's. Um, uh, super cute, you guys. So the St. Barf's line comes in a lot of sizes i think they have a petite size they have this mini size and then they have i think a medium size which i'm going to show you and then they have an even bigger size which is the large size so this is the mini size so this is the second to smallest size and i think it's just so cute you guys it's adorable and i love this cacao color the inside of her bags always come with these like pouches this, with these like weaved in pouches and it's just really nice to store items in there because the inside of these handbags are pretty much a bottomless pit and then it has the, the good thing is that the mini size has this base shaper so it gives a little bit of structure to this otherwise non-structureless handbag and then this is the strap. The mini bags come with a strap. I think the petite one does as well. So you can actually wear this cross body, right? Because it has this little piece to attach. Personally, I probably would not wear this cross body because I actually prefer the tote look of it. I think it's super cute like this and I, you know, I, that's just my preference, but you can do that with these bags. And I just, I'm just gonna store it right in here. But yeah, I'm, I'm kind of really happy with this. It does have a little bit of creasing right here because of the way it folds, but I think with stuffing it, I can get that crease out. Just very nice, you guys. You can wear this in the rain, you could wear this in the snow. I mean, I don't think I would do that, but I'm just saying, like, the material is super, super durable. It's super luxe. Here, you also have her branding in this, like, faux leather tab. And it's very discreet because it matches the color cacao. Super cute, you guys. I, I'm gonna get a lot of wear of that in these spring and summer months. I also purchased it in this beautiful color. Um, it crew. It's in the color Ecru. And this one, you guys, I'm gonna get a ton of wear out of because this one's like super, super versatile. This is gonna be a really nice summer piece. Your girl also purchased it in black. So same, same. So this is black, this is cacao, and then this is Ecru. 
and i have the trifecta of the mini sizes in these colors and they are cute they literally can match anything and they all have can have a different vibe to them. this is actually a newer um like pattern she came out with recently and actually i think it might be sold out at the moment um but tell me this one's not so cute this is adorable, you guys. And this one is called the St. Barf's Medium Size Tote in the color Athena. So this is kind of like, I guess if you would mix a crew with a white and then this pattern, it's super, super nice. Super nice. I think she also has this in the mini size, but I actually decided to go with the medium size on it. And here, I'll compare it to the, me the mini. This is the the difference this is the medium this is the mini this is super cute you guys i think it'd be really nice for the beach as a nice little beach bag or just for every day or for brunch super super cute. and i will be doing a what's in my bag on this so you guys can see on this one on the inside that's how it looks the um this pouch you know it's the same as the medium. Uh, it's just a larger size, obviously. And then the inside is just the same. It's a bottomless pit. Um, it also has the base shaper to give it a little bit of dim um, dimension, right? Because this is a shapeless handbag. But super cute, super nice. Um, I don't know. I was. It was really hard for me to choose um, which size to get because as you can see they're both quite different so i like the mini size because i think the mini size is a little bit more polished looking like for i don't know like let's say for a bunch or for like every day like you know if you just want to look chic but then i feel like the medium is just more functional more practical and it also looks very chic but it's just much big bigger and bulkier um that is why and i think i might return well i don't know you guys let me know I pretty much i bought it also in the medium this black one this is the mini though so i wasn't sure which one i wanted to keep so i'm leaning towards keeping the mini one but then at the same time i feel like oh this would be great for like the beach but then i feel like you can also use this for the beach maybe not fit as much but I don't know. <laughs> I'm conflicted, you guys. Let me know down below. But I'm definitely not keeping both. I gotta, I gotta choose one size in the cacao color because I wasn't sure if I wanted the medium or the mini. But no. for some reason, I knew that in the Accru, I definitely wanted the mini. I feel like the mini looks cute in the Accru. And then I have the medium size Athena that has the Accru color in it. So that was just perfect. But with this black and cocoa color, I don't know. But I'm definitely going to only keep one. So you guys let me know which one it should be. As I mentioned, I will do a what's in my bag on these handbags. But I definitely wanted to share with you this mind of mine that I have been really digging. Um, it's at a very good price point And... Um, it's sustainable fabrics, and I think we need to support this brand. I think it's cute. And let's be honest, it's a little bit Bottega Veneta reminiscent, right? But without the Bottega Veneta price point. Let me know your thoughts down below. Let me know if you're digging this brand, if you have already been um, familiarized with it. And I hope to talk to you guys soon. As always, if you are interested in this type of content, consider subscribing comment down below share this video like it and come on back i hope to talk to you guys soon cheers peace